Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Kelly Sparks, aka Redbeard. Gino's on his way over. We're gonna cook up some steaks. Got some uh, crawfish boudin. Got my grill going. Bonnie's acting a fool. What's up? So, to be continued. We'll be back here in a minute whenever he gets here. Stay tuned. Good chance that. Uh... Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> Me and Gene in the house. What's up, people? This is a continuation. I already told y'all he was coming over. Now, I got some food going. And see it. Searing some steaks up. Gino's over. We got some crawfish sausage. Oh, yeah. I got some potatoes in there on the skillet cooking. But uh, we'll be back momentarily whenever I get finished. Sipping a little more whiskey. Yep. Filling our bellies. Welcome back to the continuation of cooking with Kelly and Gino tonight. Uh, he hollered at me earlier. He came into town from uh, work and uh, said, fuck it, let's do up some food. And I've been waiting on him to get back. We're gonna do a quick review over this and then I'll do a separate review, review later on. This is the 2018 Lefroig Cottages. Cottages. Offering. This mm. one is this one was finished in Fino, was it Fino Sherry Casks, I believe. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, Fino Sherry Casks, so I'm really excited about this one. Been waiting on this one. Oh my god, it smells so wonderful. I mean, this, this steak looks delicious and I'm going for the whiskey first. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Don't drink it, Gene. <laughs> Put it back in the bottle. Put it back in the bottle, Gene. It it's terrible. Put it down. It's terrible. Man. Dude, this is almost... It's got a... It's got the, like this sweet vanilla. Um, hmm. That's interesting. It is interesting. Very good. I'm gonna take a bite of my steak. Try out, try that on out too. That looks interesting also. Mmm. Jane, put your steak back in the bottle. It's good. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little overcooked, but for my liking. But what do you think about that? I like it. Then there, smooth. What did, did you see what it's it was a little different from the uh, from the normal? Yeah. Did you see what it was bottled at? Uh, no. Fifty-one point eight percent. Fifty-one, really? Yeah. So it's a little. It's what uh, almost one hundred four. Now, what's the Normal, just the Lafroy carges. I will. Is that, uh, is that the the carges normally is bottled at cast strength. Okay, so it's higher than that. Mm -hmm. Well, that's that's more than likely cast strength, but that's all they got out of it. Taking taters. Probably should have took it off the grill after about mm. seven, eight minutes. It's a little well. It's all right though. I will say this, and I hate to toot my own horn, but. I can still cook a juicy, a juicy, well done steak. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's just barely. Mm -hmm. You caught it before it reached the uh, no return mm -hmm. point of no return. 
Yeah, it was on there about 13 minutes in that smoke. This has got a very, like this is all smoky food right now. The nose on this is very sweet, mm -hmm. very sweet. <clears throat> Incredibly sweet. I'm gonna have to re-review this one when I don't have so many other flavors. <clears throat> Battling it out. Mm -hmm. And I was, I can't remember, is Lafroy usually, is it a heavy, heavily peated scotch or? Mm -hmm. I thought so. Yeah, it's uh, it's not as peated as Ardbeg, but oh, depending, that's good, isn't it? After the, just the combination between the stuff. I know, right? <laughs> oh wow, that's that, fucking delicious. <clears throat> that was delicious. Man, it's like. The steak has the smoke. The steak, did you get a bite of that sausage? Not yet. It's just terrible. Put it back. <laughs> uh, Uncook it. So it's like the steak has all the smoke, and the Lafroig is just nothing but sweet. That's what I'm getting. Curtis is going to be mad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that nose is just sweet. Just all day long sweet. It doesn't look quite as dark as I thought it was going to be in the glass as it is in the bottle. So on that, on that last drink, I love the way certain foods interact yeah. with the whiskey. On that last drink, I got like this dark chocolate. Yeah. Like a, a almost like a chocolate malt. Mm. Like like you'd get it, you know, malt chocolate, you know. I like chocolate malt. Yeah. yeah. I am pretty surprised that how well it goes together with the... <laughs> Got excited. Just... Yeah, I'm gonna have to have me another glass. Right. Oh yeah, this this whiskey pairs magnificently. Yes. <clears throat> Where'd you find this Joker drip? Shreveport is the last one they had on the shelf. Mm. I asked him, I was like, you got another one? Because <laughs> I was going to buy both of them if they yeah. had two. No, I think that was the last one we got. I'm like, shit. He was like, yeah, I'm really looking, I was really wanting to try that one. I was like, <laughs> sorry about your luck, bro. I was like, I had to drive all the way over here from Longview to find it. <clears throat> Did you know it was over there? or? Mm -mm. So you just had to get surprised all the way around. Oh yeah, because I uh, we went over there for uh, uh, Stephen's birthday, and before the festivities began, I went to the one little liquor store. If you're ever in uh, Shreveport, Louisiana, go to the Cuban. They have a very good selection. They got a bunch of stuff off in there. It's a really good store. I don't get anything for saying that, but it's good stuff. Wow. Uh, a Cuban. Downtown. Um, you take, uh, was that 49? Mm -hmm. 49 going south. Mm -hmm. You take 49 going south, and it's down there, not quite to King's Highway. Mm -hmm. It's down in that direction. Okay. <clears throat> uh, you know where Superior Barn Grill is? Yeah. It's back up the hill and around the corner from spirit it's like a mile away um, but I was in there looking and I was looking at the bourbons first didn't even think about it because like they got the bourbons on this side and the scotch are behind them 
and I'm going through the bourbons, looking at them, like nothing I saw that I really wanted. And then I turned around, and it was like a like a beacon in the night. I was like, it's glowing. <laughs> Push everybody out of the way. <laughs> well, the good thing about Lafroy, get another one, <laughs> is uh, people aren't just running running out into the streets to uh, find it. <laughs> so. Yeah, that's pretty damn tasty. Yeah, man. Grilled, good old grilled steak with some. Did some roasted potatoes. Mm -hmm. I did the same thing. Everybody out there in YouTube land got to see me the other night. I made a pot roast, and I told them about like I'm doing whatever this airs. Ah, shit! I might just throw this in the middle just for special shits and giggles, but I'm doing Irish whiskey all this week because St. Patty's Day is on uh, Sunday. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'm doing like Irish, that's why I got the Irish whiskey sitting right there. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm gonna throw this just smack dab in the middle of everything, just just add it in there. <clears throat> and, uh, forgot what I was gonna add. Oh yeah, I did, I, did a, I was like, hey guys, this is what I'm doing, but I had a, uh, some pot roast that I made and need some roasted potatoes just like this. Shit was good. I imagine it was. Well, it was like Oreos and cook. I mean, milk right there. <laughs> yeah, man. I think it probably spent about two to three minutes too long on that grill. This is a hair. Not too long to where it, you know, completely upsets you. I mean, it's not like eating a boot. <laughs> so do this, do this. Let's try this. Take and cut you off a thin little sliver of steak. Sliver. Take a bite of this. Start chewing it up while it's still in your mouth. Mm, combination. Take a sip. <clears throat> It's disgusting, everybody. Don't do it. <laughs> if you find this on the shelf, contact me immediately, and I will... Ship it right over. Come get it. <laughs> Post haste. You won't have to worry about it. Man down. Man down. You won't, <laughs> <laughs> you won't have to worry about it. But I think we're going to go ahead and cut it off there. What do you think, Gene? Well, that's pretty damn good. <clears throat> not worth the uh, purchase yeah I've waited a while for that mm. this one was actually uh, now how long has it been out I mean June of last year and you just now found a bottle just now like two weeks ago mm. found a bottle mm. so I found it in February <clears throat> end of February so so it's been out for shit eight months. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Last bottle, and we are enjoying it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. So I'll go ahead Maybe. and huh? What? I'll take it. <laughs> you need another one? You want to read that? Man, if you don't mind, put it up to about right there, maybe. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Well, I think we'll go ahead and uh, I think we'll go ahead and stop it here. We're gonna finish this food and then go outside and smoke some yeah. cigars and drink more whiskey. I'm gonna put this up because we'll end up killing this bottle tonight. Yes, we need to hide that bottle. Uh, We're only but, stopping the video, not the not the eating or the drinking. <laughs> the eating and drinking mm -hmm. will continue. So uh, uh, don't forget to check out the bearded idiots. We uh, post funny shit all the time. I'm wearing the merch tonight. Uh, but, yeah. Hopefully y'all like the uh, Thursday night at Kelly's Gino's story. 
I just released that one for everybody. <laughs> it's been uploaded for months now, but oh well. The good old days. Yeah. <clears throat> Running from the popo. But. Gotta make them earn it. <laughs> gotta make them earn it. Damn straight. <laughs> make them earn it. I got it too easy. Yeah. <clears throat> but I think that's all I got. Yeah. That's a lot. Yeah, it is a lot. <laughs> so, uh, like always, drink some whiskey, eat a steak, share that shit with your friends and family. Have a nice day. Y'all take Adios. care, folks.